on, Joe. Do you know what time it is? It's time to go on a field trip. Before we go, we need to talk about being safe on a school bus. On a field trip. Come on, Jane. Let's board the bus and show them how it's done. <laughs> When you get ready to board the school bus, wait for it to come to a complete stop and for the door to open before getting close and then getting on. Always make sure the driver is on the bus before you board. We have to get on the bus one student at a time. Come on. Hey, no pushing. And no shoving. Use the handrails to get on the bus safely and if you can, fill the back seats first working your way forward. Sit with your face forward with your back and pockets on the seat. Remember, never stand up or move seats. If you're sharing a seat, slide all the way over to the window to allow your seatmate in. Always remain in your seat while the bus is in motion. And no sticking your arms or head out the window or anything else. Keep your feet out of the aisles and no food or beverages on the bus unless it's approved by your driver. And don't be so loud the driver can't concentrate on safe driving. And always keep the aisles clear of your personal stuff like backpacks. And hey, no bringing animals on the bus, no matter how cute they are. When you arrive at your field trip location, wait until the bus comes to a complete stop before standing up. Get off the bus one at a time without pushing or shoving. And when you get off the bus, make sure you know your bus number. Bus number is located here by the front door, in the back of the bus, and on the side of the bus. You got that? Got it! The bus driver will always tell our teacher where he or she will pick us up after the field trip's over. And your bus driver will tell you what time we will be picked up. You got it? If there is an emergency and you have to get off the bus quickly, there are emergency exits on the back of the bus, the side of the bus, and on the roof of the bus. If there is an emergency and we have to evacuate, listen up, this is how it's done. When you're asked to evacuate the bus, leave all lunch boxes, books, backpacks, and other items on the bus. Exit the bus safely and orderly one row at a time from the left side of the bus to the right side. Designated student helpers will be the first to exit outside the emergency exits by sitting on the floor and dropping feet first to the ground. Then they'll help you get safely off the school bus. When it's your turn to evacuate at the emergency exit, place the palm of your hand on the upturned palm of the student helper's hand. Bend your knees and step. Don't jump to the ground. When we are all safely off the bus, our bus driver will tell us to meet at a designated place at least 100 feet from the bus. Okay guys, let's go meet up over by that light pole. When we get off the bus, we should go immediately to where our bus driver told us to meet. And then we need to stay here and wait for the bus driver. And when the bus comes to a railroad crossing, everyone needs to be extra quiet so our bus driver can open the door to look and listen for trains and get us across the railroad crossing safely. When the field trip is over, make sure you don't leave anything behind on the bus. Don't stand up until the bus comes to a complete stop. Get off the bus without pushing or shoving. And don't forget to thank your bus driver. Thank you! So there you have it. Now you know how to be safe on the school bus on your field trip. And always remember, Safety first. Got it? Got it.